Ketchup has a questionable past. According to one theory, it comes from the Chinese kitsap, a type of sauce. Another theory traces it to European pickling sauces, and yet another claims Arabic origins. But there's widespread agreement on where it ends up, on hot dogs, hamburgers, and french fries. Tomato ketchup recipes vary only slightly, as consumers expect a certain familiar tomato-y taste. This U.S. company produces all-natural ketchup, made entirely of certified organic ingredients. Tomato paste, agave nectar, a natural sweetener, onion powder, spices, salt, and white vinegar. The tomato paste, not surprisingly, is the base ingredient. It arrives at the plant in huge bins which have been vacuum packed to preserve freshness. After unsealing each bin, the factory's quality control technician scoops a sample for testing. This is to make sure the thickness is just right. If the sample gets the okay, workers slide the bin under a powerful air-driven pump. Then they flip a switch, and the pump begins moving the tomato paste to a large holding tank, transferring nearly 140 kilograms of this ketchup base in less than 10 minutes. At production time, an intricate system of piping transfers a specific amount of tomato paste from the holding tank into a cooking kettle. As the paste cooks, a mixer continuously revolves to keep it from sticking to the sides and to blend in the onion powder workers add next. This and the upcoming ingredients have been pre-measured to be in correct proportion to the batch size. The next ingredients are salt, then, as a sugar replacement, nectar from the agave plant. They pour in an initial amount, mix a bit, then pump in the remainder. The last ingredient is white vinegar. For competitive reasons, the company won't divulge the mixing time, cooking time or cooking temperature, all of which are key elements of this top secret recipe. On the packaging line, an alignment machine stands the plastic bottles upright as they make their way to the filling machine. The finished ketchup, meanwhile, is passing through an elaborate system of cooling pipes en route to the filler. And let the bottling begin. The machine fills eight bottles at a time. 150 bottles per minute. The factory tests every batch of ketchup it produces to ensure the correct consistency in every bottle. The next machine, appropriately called the capper, places a plastic flip cap on each bottle, then, with spinning circular belts, twists it on securely. The next machine cuts a decorative neckband made of plastic film and slips it over the cap. Each bottle then passes under an air jet. The air blows the neckband downward until it's positioned under the cap. Then a quick blast of hot steam shrinks the band to a tight fit. The next machine presses on two adhesive labels, one on the front of the bottle, the other on the back. Then it's off to the packing and shipping area. A sealed bottle of ketchup stays fresh for at least a year because the vinegar in it acts as a natural preservative. Ketchup also has health benefits because it's chock full of tomatoes, which are high in lycopene, a powerful antioxidant believed to protect against many types of cancer.